god. Oh, that hurt. That hurt my nuts. Watch out, birds! Oh! Oh! Wow, these, that baby got back. Jeez, a lot of back. Ooh. Oh, this is where the horses are. There's horses everywhere. You're seeing me go around Galveston Island. Hey everyone, I made it to Galveston Island again. This time the family wanted to go and uh, we're at Stewart Beach. Uh, there it is, there's the bike here. Got the camelback, the water camelback on this and uh, my bike and I'm gonna be riding it out here. So, all right, fun day, Galveston Island. Welcome back. Uh, hold on here. I'm at uh, Stewart Beach. Let me make some adjustments here to my chest mount. I'm gonna, this is where we went to. We paid here, we paid for parking, so kind of a little bit easier for me. I don't have to ride, I don't have to drag my family around. But uh, this is a beach test for the Rad Mini. All right, this is sand. We're gonna go on some sand out here. Wait for the uh, tractor to go by first. Uh, okay, so I already been through here, so the Rad Mini does handle the slightly soft sand. Oh, so, oh. Uh, all right. <laughs> Slid just a move, just a little bit, but I didn't reduce the tire pressure or anything. It's 20 psi is normal. It's pretty compact out here, so I already been out here, and uh, I'm just gonna. Go around the beach. What this is? No steels, posts, tarps, tents. No tarps. Oh. Anyways, I'm just gonna go down one end and go down the other. And that's all I'm gonna do. My seat is a little bit lower, just so if I come into some sand, I put my foot down. That's all, that's all it's for. So that's what I'm doing. I'll get into soft sand and I'll, the front will slide and I'll put my foot down. That's all it is. Oh, thank you. So I'm gonna try to find compact ground, but that's also another reason why I'm not gonna go fast. But I am on pedal assist two, gear two. So that's all I'm doing today. It's just going around riding my bike. Oh, and I'll, I'll ride a little bit of the. Uh, this is uh, Stewart Beach. That's all this place is. And I guess here you could just drive your car. You could drive your car. People are fishing. People are fishing. It's a lot smoother here. I think they wet it down, or it's more compact. So it looks like I left Stewart Beach and I'm on some public road, maybe. Uh. <laughs> I'm a little bit lower than I normally would be. I feel like I should actually raise the seat just a little bit. Let me raise the seat just a little bit. I'm not feeling comfortable and I know I'm going to burn out my knees. <laughs> I have my kickstand on too. I left my, I left my <laughs> kickstand on and I got my water drink here.
Just a little bit higher. Just so I could get better leg extension. Gosh. I feel like, uh... I feel like my knees are gonna come give out on me and I could yeah I could still stand up I'm okay okay this feels more comfortable oh yeah way more comfortable get better knee extension okay I could do this all right there we go so yeah I'm just gonna ride the beach a little bit just have some fun man look at those houses look at that building All right, get away from the crowd a little bit. Just have some fun. Okay, pedal test seven. Okay, I didn't bring my suspension seat post. I just didn't want another thing to have it on me, carry around. You know how it is. Pedal test three, gear seven. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So doing some beach riding. Now if you're wondering why I'm at the beach, because my youngest wanted to be at the beach, so. Oh God, oh, that hurt. That hurt my nuts. Oh, oh, that hurt my nuts. Oh, oh. There was a, there was a, I don't know if you can call it a pothole, but there was a dip and the front, the front and the back just, oh, it hit my nuts and oh God, oh, I'm regretting not bringing my suspension seat post. <laughs> I should have, but you know what? It is what it is. I'm on sand. What am I whining about? Oh, don't crap on me. All right. So I see everyone riding their bikes. I'm gonna ride my bike here. Just because I'm at a higher speed. I'm going, I think the speed limit is 15 miles an hour, but I know right off the bat that I'm on pedal sys three and I could ride like 20, 20 miles on this easy. And I'm gonna go past through everyone. So I'm gonna be here. And the sand is compact enough. Sand is compact enough. I don't know where I'm going, to be honest with you. I'm just riding. So I, I don't have my helmet. What I do have is uh, my bump cap and my uh, high-vis gray. Uh, breathable cap, baseball cap, with the bump cap in it. And that's what I have. And I already took a dip in the water. I took a dip in the ocean. So I'm actually very cool and feels breathy. Breathy? <laughs> it feels it feels very cool. Even though it's probably very hot and humid. I'm wearing breathable. I'm wearing my usual. My fisherman's shirt. Compression uh, tights. Swimming trunks. But no high-vis jacket. Just this salmon pink shirt and uh, uh, like uh, neon turquoise swimming trunks. Watch out birds! Ah! Anyways, let's see how far this island goes. I'll just keep riding all day long. It's a little bumpy, but you know what? It's sand. It's not that bad. Oh yeah. Wow, look at these homes on the left. Anyways, no one has uh, stopped me, and I, I kind of read the, the news, or not the news, the uh, the rules. It says no ATV, but it doesn't say anything about bicycles. So I'm like, okay. And I've seen other people with bicycles, so I'm going to be out here. I'm on this, this side because uh, this is where I guess the rescue patrol would be, and sometimes the police, because I go a little bit faster, and I don't want to be around people. That's just the way it is. I'm, I'm happy to be at the beach. I don't have to be, I already took a dip in the ocean. So I'm really, I, I need uh, 
<laughs> oh. Wow. You all right? <laughs> No problem, no problem. Sorry about your kite. Oh, no, this is just falling, actually. Okay. Is it clear? Yeah, yeah. All right, man. Have a good one. Okay. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> a little bit dangerous. A little dangerous. I got clothesline by... Uh, I got clotheslined by uh, <laughs> a kite. Uh, I'm adjusting my uh, my camel. There we go. So uh, this is the first time I'm using the, my backpack as a camel. Anyways, so apparently there was a kite that flew over or was there, and it was, the string was still attached. I didn't even know. I didn't even see the string. Anyways, I don't know if I'm on a private beach or what the deal is, but I'm just gonna keep riding until someone tells me otherwise. As far as I know, the rules, uh, I mean, I saw cars over here, for goodness sake. I think there's an area for cars, but I'm just gonna keep riding until uh, well, someone says something. Oh, it feels a lot cooler right here for some reason. Anyways. If I get overheated, if I get overheated, I'll just uh, I'll just jump right in the water and come back out. <laughs> or maybe I can't do that with all the gear I have on. But oh, wow! Did you see that baby got back. Jeez, a lot of back. Ooh. I got slightly distracted. I was almost uh, curving out. So this time I'm all set up. I'm all set up. I got my uh, sandals, outdoor socks. I don't know where I'm going. No idea where I'm going at this point in time. Well, I'll just keep on riding. I mean, uh, <laughs> I think it's an island. I'll reach uh, one end eventually. How much battery I got? I don't know. <laughs> I hope my wife can find me if I, ever, if I ever don't come back. Anyways, hope you all enjoy the ride. Maybe we'll get to see some more uh, more action here. <sighs> Anyways, why? <laughs> normally, I I wouldn't go to the beach at all, mainly because uh, I have like you know four or five swimming pools to go to. And most of them by a lake anyway, so 
and pedal assist down to two. A lot of people here. Uh. Wow, crowded today. <laughs> don't, don't mind me. <laughs> Pedestrians are king here at the beach. Oh, is that a, I don't know what that is. Is that a banana shop or something? I'm on pedal assist seven, gear two, or pedal, se pedal assist two, gear seven. Man, people are partying out here. Ooh. Oh, that's a Kona Island. Kona Ice. I thought it was an ambulance. Oh. I thought it was an ambulance. It's not. It's Kona Ice. Ooh. You know, I wonder if you can, uh, if you can ride the whole Galveston Island. Oh, it's bumpy but sandy. It's weird. Oh, this is where the horses are. There's horse shit everywhere. By the way, you can, it's okay to have, <laughs> you can ride your horses on, on the beach here. You can drive your, you can take your car to the beach. I can see the horse tracks. It's, it's weird. The sand looks, it looks soft. Let me, let me put this down. There's horse shit here. Gear down a little bit. Wow, really? I, I think I reached the end of the beach. I'll be damned. And it looks really clear over there. I might be able to ride in peace. Awesome. Ugh. I'm, uh, what do you call it? Fishtailing a little bit, but not a lot. Uh, let's go out closer to the, to the, to the uh, sand out here. Oh, there we go, much smoother. Okay. Uh, Should have brought my suspension seat post, but that's all right. It's sand. I was thinking sand, but it's, it's all right. You know, I only have so much room. Hopefully I won't get a flat. I'm a long ways. I'm a long ways from the car. I left, the, I left all my equipment in the car. Normally I wouldn't, uh, normally I would not, uh, leave without it, but this is kind of like a one-time deal, so I didn't, I don't have limited room in the car. Oh, smells. Has that, that's, this is ocean smell right here. I'm going around <laughs> Galveston Island right now. You're seeing me go around Galveston Island. Uh, dude, this is, uh, <laughs> this is, if I keep going around... It'll eventually get up to the uh, intercoastal canal. You'll eventually get up to the intercoastal canal. Oh, it's getting uh, shifty right here. So you eventually get up to the coastal intercoastal canal, and that's why you're seeing all these commercial ship and vessels out here. That's where the boats actually, probably, most likely launch from. Yeah, I just I just literally went around Galveston. I'm around Galveston right now. There's more horse shit right there. Oh man. I don't know how much further I want to go, but uh, there's a bird over there. I wanted to bring my binoculars, but uh, unfortunately, um, oh, they saw me. They're coming to attack me. Nope. This is really nice. I like bird watching. I should have bought my binoculars, but uh, I didn't. Let me just go ahead and get a camera shot of this. I'm gonna get a camera shot. This 
to share with all of you guys. All right, there you go. Camera shot. Let's see if I can zoom in, I can. That's the max I can zoom in right there. Look at all those birds. And I got a nice, I got a nice cool breeze coming through here. Man. Isn't that wonderful? I get to uh, bring the Rad Mini with me, escape the rat race, and uh, get a nice cool breeze with nobody around. And if you know me, you know I enjoy I enjoy bird watching. Anyways. All right, I guess I'll go back around, see if I can find my family, or I could get onto the seawall. Or I could get onto the seawall, which I think I, that's what I'm going to do, is get on the seawall. And uh, ride the seawall. I'm still at full battery, and uh, I, barely did, <laughs> I barely did like maybe uh, 15, 15 minutes of riding. And I'm already on the other side of Galveston. Of course, I was kind of already there. I was at Stewart Beach. All right, let's uh, let's uh, let's head head on back. 